Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome to the channel today. If you enjoyed this review, please drop a like and please subscribe down below. I appreciate all the support from everybody, new, old subscribers, whoever you are. It's great that you're here. I really do appreciate the channel growing. It means a lot. And we have something interesting here. So you have an orange box, white Nike swoosh, plain and simple. When I first saw the box, I did not realize it was an actual Air Force One box. This is different. Um, it's not too familiar for a general release. I don't remember when they used this orange box. I'm a huge fan of Air Forces. But anyway, this is an Air Force 107 LV-8 in white green strike aquamarine. Interesting color combo. Men's size 12. And the retail price was $110 US. And this particular pair released, I believe it was April 2nd. I'll double check that and you'll see in text for $110. And this is what we have in front of us today. So before I bring the show up and give you the details up close, I wanted to explain where this inspiration came from. Supposedly, they were going for a 90s nostalgic vintage vibe in terms of color usage and design and kind of what resembles the 90s. I'll throw a couple of photos up here. You have kind of this uh, shape design geometric, very colorful that was big in the 90s. I actually had a pair of sheets as a kid that were similar to that design, you see. And then there was a big advertisement when we were kids. One was Cindy Crawford with the surfboard once again the color usage the way that the uh, advertisements were done uh, the way show introductions were done back in the 90s it was very nostalgic for me some of you may look at it now and not know about it because you're just too young but if you watch some of the old stuff probably youtube has videos you'll see the 90s had a lot of color a lot of vibrancy and honestly it was just a really great decade so this is where this was coming from. We have a all white synthetic style upper. It is a decent leather quality. It is not bad. I'm not gonna, you know, knock them too much. This is a really, really, really good sneaker for the springtime as you can tell. Being all white, you have a little bit of touch of a blue down over here, which I'm assuming is that aquamarine color because it's like a teal blue, almost reminds me of like Caribbean water, just a little bit darker. Uh, it's a little lighter than it looks on camera though. Your swoosh right here has an interesting pattern to it. So it almost looks like a paint drip graffiti in a way. Or like airbrush. Airbrush is probably what I was looking for. And it's got a combination of that green strike. But it looks like there's a little aquamarine kind of in it. And yeah, I just really like the way they put this together in terms of the style and what they were aiming for. If we flip it around to the heel, you can see a black leather heel tab with some black leather accenting going down the heel. There is the green strike stitched in with the nike air back there on the heel tab the aquamarine kind of highlights down there on the white midsole with white stitching there is white contrasted stitching on the paneling as long as you can pick it up yeah you can see it right there it's on there on the swoosh as well so they didn't really change any of the stitching that's all a white color there is the outsole in plain white there is a look at your perforated leather toe box with your silver air force one lace dubray the tongue is made of the same leather going around the upper. It's going to be a little hard for me to pick up the detail, but you can kind of see the grain there. And your tongue tag up top on the leather is actually kind of the most 90s design you have on the shoe, which shows that kind of airbrushing style they were going on the swoosh. So once again, you got all the colors mixed in there. Here is a highlighting vibrancy. It's like a... Um, What's that color? Fuchsia? Fuchsia? I'm pronouncing that wrong. You know what I'm trying to say? That fuchsia pink or whatever? And overall, it's a pretty basic, basic looking Air Force One. There's a look at your aquamarine insole with the Nike Air. Your white lining. There is your look at the laces, which is only one pair of laces. But it is a white flat lace with a green stripe tip, so it kind of matches the design. I like that. And with all these vibrant hues, these neon colors, I just really, really enjoy these. These will not be going anywhere. They're staying in my collection. If you guys didn't know, Air Forces are my favorite silhouette in terms of sneakers. Jordans hold a lot of nostalgia to me because I watched Jordan growing up. But Air Force Ones to me have always been my favorite. That's probably because I grew up in New York. But it's also just a really, really simple, simple sneaker. They have so many different designs, so many different collaborations, so many ones that I don't have that I still want to hunt down. And on top of that, I just love the way they're cut. I feel like they look good with shorts, pants, any kind of pants. doesn't matter if they're jeans, joggers, sweatpants, uh, cargo, whatever, dress pants. I mean, they look good. And they're simple. They're kind of like Stan Smiths. You know, they're hard to make them look bad. But overall, I think this sneaker did really, really great. 
I think you guys should take a look at these. I don't know where they'll be in stock. If they are in stock, you can check the links down in the description below where you can see any place you can buy them that would be safe. If the link is not down there, I personally probably would not buy from that store or I just couldn't find them at another store. But you get what I'm trying to say. I'm not going to leave any links down there that would be shady and try to get you guys, you know, scammed or something like that. That's the last thing I would want. And that's really about it for today. I mean, there's not really too much else to talk about. I really like what they did with this Air Force One. It's pretty simple. Great colors. Great 90s vibe going on. And I'm enjoying it. So let me know what you guys think down below these. I'm really curious um, your thoughts because these did go kind of quick on Nike's website. That's why I'm not quite sure what other store has them in stock. But once again, check down below if you are interested. Other than that, I will try to answer back to everybody. Get some conversation going. Great to hear from you guys. Um, I thank you guys for stopping by today. I appreciate all the support from everybody. I hope you guys stick around. I have some more stuff coming very shortly. have some more videos coming out. And I hope to see you guys around in the next video. All right. Have a good day.